I found this piece of glass a little while ago, leaning against the wall. It said, toughen glass, free, please take it. Now, I don't know if it truly is toughened glass, but if you've ever wondered if you can countersink it, I think it was like a, a mid-shelf for um, a DVD unit or a TV stand. So I don't know if that stuff is toughened or not, but I've just managed to countersink my first hole. What we got here is I just bored it until I got no rock across the head of the bolt using a stone mason's grind bit I bought on AliExpress. There are 10 millimeter holes in this glass and uh, let's try and get some sound out of it. Sound, it's eight millimeter glass, tough and supposedly. Right, let's just get this. And uh, there's no shelling whatsoever in it. So I don't know if this is really tough and glass or not. But let me just try and do this one handed, just to show you. I mean, a double sticky back plastic tip just in case the thing exploded so I could throw it in the bin. But a little bit of PTFE lube. <clears throat> right. Uh, right, where is the hole? Let's not smash it while trying to line a drill bit up. I've got it on slow speed. Tissue wired. Lost it. Alright, um, as you can see, it's already started to provide a counterboard. <laughs> Got a long way to go, but <clears throat> Hopefully, I'll get there and there eight, that's an 8mm countersunk bolt. When I eventually bolt this to something, I have sourced some plastic shields that will go into a 10mm hole for an 8mm bolt from Accu Components, I think it is, accu.co.uk. Um, I'll, I'll provide the link in the description. Right. So I can make make the missus a, a tabletop for her arts and crafts that she can pull in over the chair while she's sitting down. So if I put a leg on the bottom of that and then have it so the glass can fold down and have um, like a, a T-section wooden tenoned piece as the backing so it'll branch in past the midway point Alright, let's pass the midway point that way across the glass and then parallel to this top edge so it's giving it support and put a leg on it and then put a, an under, a leg that will slide underneath the sofa so, sofa so she can pull it in. That's the plan anyway, let's see how far I get. Well, that's the first vid, see you all later, thanks for watching.